I'm Brigham Larson with Brigham Larson Pianos. This piano just barely came out of the shop and is in perfect condition. We, we go through these pianos super, super thoroughly, like to the extreme, and this piano was no exception. We went through it top to bottom and it is now in perfect condition. What we're really going for, there's, there's kind of a gap in the market um, between pianos that you can find on online, Craigslist or whatever, used for $50 or $100 or whatever, and then brand new pianos that you can find for um, maybe in the high threes at best, low fours usually is where brand new pianos start. So what we're trying to do is, is provide uh, pianos that are in brand new condition, both cosmetically and functionally, for, um, for right in that middle, right in the middle uh, price zone. So that's, that's what this piano is. It's in brand new condition, though it's originally it's a 1961, and I'll show you what we did to it to why I make that claim that it's in, it's in brand new condition. Um, why, don't we, why don't we quickly check out the shop real quick. We do lots of, lots of restorations, so pianos like this one, this 1910 Steinway, and then this, uh, this little Baldwin Hypersonic, and lots of, lots of older pianos over there in those mirrors. And here's the shop back here where, uh, where we have lots and lots of pianos that are, that are in various stages underway, and that's where this piano got its new life. So let's talk about what that entails. So, start with start with cosmetics. Cosmetically, um, it's in it's in nearly perfect condition. Probably not A plus, but A definitely A condition. If you wanted to nitpick, um, you could probably find little tiny 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 details to to complain about. But uh, but it's pretty close to perfect. Um, so refinished, um, and then uh, and then of course the. The metal hardware, like like the knobs and the pedals and, and that sort of thing, those have been those have been polished and, and buffed and redone. And then the keys, we've we've gone through and, and buffed those keys to a to a high polish, so they're back to and, and kind of taken out the the scratches and, and the wear that they've seen over the last what 1961. So what is that 50? Um, I guess that's 58 years now. So, uh, yeah, cosmetically perfect. And then on the inside, here we have the, uh, the guts. I'll open this up. The vast majority of the work that we do, as, as good as this piano looks, the majority, what, what we're really going for is, is to make it sound and play as good, if not better, than, than it looks. So the vast majority of the work that we do is on the guts. So first thing that we do is we clean everything very thoroughly. All, all pianos, even, even pianos that are, that are as little as uh, five or 10 years old are gonna be super dirty on the inside. So we, we take the action out, we take the keys out, we take all the cabinetry off that can possibly come off. We clean everything with a uh, figurative fine tooth comb to ensure that it's as clean as we possibly can get it and then we reshape the hammer so the hammers over time they get uh, they get misshapen that's my wife um, call her back um, they get misshapen from from striking the striking the strings year after year and so and so it, it, it goes from a proper um, shape, which is a kind of a rounded point hitting the string to kind of a flattened surface, which is detrimental to the tone. And there again, even even a five or ten year old piano, they'll they'll have some significant grooves where where that that is developing. And so uh, so we remove all of that. We we return it to its to its correct shape. Then we go through and and do any repairs and repinning that might be necessary. We tighten everything up properly align everything so rather than those those hammers hitting off to one side or the other or kind of glancing off of off of the strings like they're not supposed to they're going to be hitting dead center straight on exactly in their target back to how it's supposed to be we regulate everything so that uh, so it, um, everything is functioning correctly so for example uh, the distance here from the hammers to the strings, that's the correct distance. There's a very specific distance that, uh, that that's supposed to be. Then we have this distance, 
right there. The hammer is supposed to come to within an eighth of an inch when you play extremely slowly. It's supposed to come to within an eighth of an inch of the string and then it pulls away. That's called the let off distance. And we have, you can see all of that is correctly at one eighth of an inch. And things like the checking distance, which is that distance when I hold the key down, that hammer is supposed to be approximately two thirds of the way to the string, which as you can see here in this on this piano, these hammers, they check at that two thirds or so. It, it varies depending on how hard you hit it. Then there's there's about uh, there's a handful of other specs that, that are supposed to be correct. Um, so you have the, the proper touch. So, uh, and, and a few other things like pedals and, and adjustments, making sure everything is, is functioning. Like I said at the beginning of this video, like it's brand new. We've done literally thousands of pianos over the years. And so, uh, so we're very experienced, we're very good at what we do. Um, very confident in the quality of our craftsmanship and the durability of these pianos as well. Okay, let's play it. come in, try it, see what you think. The address here is 1497 South State Street in Orem, and the phone number is 801-701-0113. Thanks for watching.